Hello everyone, in this video we are going to see how to use equal sub parameter. Equal sub parameter is used when you are using sum fields equal to none. If you don't e give equals, by default is no equals. Okay, no equals is default. You need not write explicitly, but no equals is default. So what do we mean by equals and what do we mean by no equals? For example, if you want to remove duplicates, you can use sum fields equal to none in sort program. Okay, what do you mean by duplicate record? If the primary key or the unique identifier is repeating, it's a duplicate record. If the complete record is duplicate, you can trust on sort. If the record, if one of the record is correct out of the duplicate records, sort program cannot pick, I mean, pick the record properly. For example, let me take the example. Let me show the file, input file. So this is the input file. Sort program can be used if exact record is duplicate. For example, 1ACC1 is present twice, thrice. Okay, there are four times. If I'm finding 1ACC1 item number, it is repeating four times. It can be anywhere. It need not be in this next to next. But what we are, how we are removing duplicate, we are bringing next to next by using sort fields okay sort fields in sort fields we are going to give the unique identifier here in this file item number is the unique identifier it is going to sort sort is going to group the data okay then pick one of these records by default it picks one of these records it doesn't know whether this is correct or this is correct or this is correct it doesn't know okay but here in this case all records all these four items okay all exactly same image copy record is repeated okay you can pick any of these records sort picks one of these records okay but suppose so we don't have item name, brand name here suppose the third duplicate record is having correct brand name then this is a correct record so in this case these case of duplicate records we can't trust on sort program because sort program works on a different routine in, in that routine it is going to pick one of these four records okay we, for this purpose we can't use sort record so where we can use sort record sort program for removing duplicates if all the reg records are exactly same or if the first record is correct suppose this record is not correct all the other records are not correct okay it could be correct record also Okay, if the first record is correct or first record is correct, then we can use sort, sort program. If all the records are exactly same image copy, you can just give sort fields and sum fields without equals. Okay, if the first record, very first record is always correct, you are 100% sure the first record is the correct record, then you have to give equals. So what does the equals mean? Equals is going to bring the first duplicate record very simple okay if you don't give equals it will going to bring one of the duplicate records if you give equals it will always bring the first duplicate record first occurrence of the duplicate record okay so you can use sort program provided the first record is duplicate in that case you have to give, you give equals for sure if you don't give equals it is going to bring a random record you can also use sort program if all the duplicate records are same image copy okay i'm going to execute this and show you i'm going to save this file here there are quite a few items you can see 1acc0 there are two records okay 1ac0 there are two duplicate second is not correct i give an arrow mark here there is no unit price Similarly, 1ACC4, let me search the items, there are two duplicate, it is adjacent to each other, it can be anywhere in fact. Okay, this is, I have given an arrow mark here. So we are not supposed to bring this in output. Similarly, 1ACD1, there are two records, in one of the records, quantity is missing, we have a space. Okay, there are totally, there are quite a few duplicate 1ACC0 
one AC C one, which we have just introduced, and one AC C four. Okay, these are and one AC D one. There are four records which are repeating more than once. But out of all these four, the very first record is the correct record. So we can use sort program if the first record is correct record, or if all the records are exactly same. Okay, what I'm going to do? I'm going to execute the JCL. You have to understand the importance of equals sub parameter. It will be aiding you to bring the first duplicate record. Max is equal to zero. I'm going to browse. You can see the output. Okay, this is the input. In fact, what's the output file? This is the output file. You can see you can see proper records. One AC C one C gate, and we don't have any arrow marks. All quantity and price are filled. So this is how you have to use equals sub parameter. If you don't give equals by default, it's no equals. So sort program will undergo a routine. That routine will decide which is the record to be picked out of the duplicate record. But if you give equals, it will always pick the first dupe. Hope you understood how to use equals sub parameter. Thanks for watching this video.